All right, guys. Top of the morning. Yes, we are ready to go. Good morning, beautiful people. Corey Dooley here. So this is strong. Um, I have a bench just for the sit squats. It just is a reminder for me. So when I'm squatting, I kind of zone off. And if I don't feel my butt tap on the bench, then I know I'm probably going this level. So if you have a bench, great. Use it as a proprioceptor. If you don't, it's all good as well. Um, and then your dumbbells, and we will get started. Make sure you modify or progress to how you feel. Okay, respect yourself. Feet are nice and wide. Toes, hips, everything. Shoulders facing straight forward. We're gonna side and side. Just push your hands into your quadriceps. And as you push back, nice long spine. Just feel the inner and outer thighs warming up. Good, and let's take that right arm and reach and then pull. Reach and pull. You can reach down to the floor. You can reach straight. It's up to you. Just kind of bringing that blood flow up a little bit. Body temperature. Notice in how good you feel on this beautiful Thursday. Good. Keep going. Let's just switch hands. So left side, reach and pull. Reach and pull. Maybe tap the floor, pull up. And as you tap the floor, are you dropping your chest more? Or are you pushing your hips and your butt back? A little bit of both. Pull that arm. So we have some side lunges today where we're gonna do the same where you're pulling back behind you, working the back of that shoulder. Upper back. Good, and back to center and just push. Side to side. And we're gonna pull that right leg in and just give me a reverse lunge with the arms straight up to the ceiling, opposite side. Reach the arms, push the chest. Slide that knee down towards the floor. Good. Yes. Ugh. Keep re reverse lunge with the legs. Open the arms. Squeeze together. So chest. A little bit of back. And notice if your body is tight. How those hip flexors feel. Keep the feet apart. Push the knee almost to the floor. Breathe. Good. Last one and release. All right, guys. So we're going to go to the bench or just a sit squat. Two dumbbells on your shoulders. So feet can be wide. Feet can be closer together. Whatever feels best for your body. From a side view, you're just coming here. I like to touch my elbows on my quadriceps. And then I come up. We're going to alternate shoulder press. Now, I'm going to start off on my bench. If you have one, do so. Again, remember the height. So you're wanting to get low. And we're going to do this nice and slow for a minute. Are we ready? Here we go. Stand up. Shoulder press right side. Tap the butt. Shoulder press left side. Now, you want to go ahead and progress and do both arms at the same time because your weights are lighter. Feel free to do that. But we have a shoulder press without the legs on the other side, with both arms. So just telling you what's coming, yes. Exhale, inhale down. Nice. Less than 30 seconds. Look good, Leanne. Go, Michelle. Perfect. Squeeze a little butt. Keep that chest lifted. Perfect. One more. One more on the left. Good. Now, just standing, I want you to split stand, our feet together. 45 seconds, both shoulder presses. Ready? Three, two, let's go. So push it up, down slow. Push it up. I like to turn my palms facing each other. You can turn them towards the camera. 
It's up to you. You can walk around. You can sit. Come on. Slow on the down. Slow. Perfect. You got 20 seconds. Morning, Sammy. <laughs> Woohoo! Less than 10. And last one. Excellent. All right, guys, so the same weight, you have two dumbbells. You're going to give me a jackknife. I'll face forward. Right foot is anchored, and right side is going to row. So the options are you do a slight reverse lunge, you hinge over, and you row, and you come straight back up. Okay? So from the side, it looks like this with the progression. I go flat, I hold, look at the floor, and then my same foot that's anchored, I drive the elbow behind and I come straight back up. Only one side is rowing, only one foot is staying anchored. So I'm gonna switch feet, stay on the right side. When you go over, try to avoid going really low, just go tabletop, drop the chest, hold this, and then give me that high elbow row. 